I'd like to show you how to add a reference document to a LiveDocs corpus in MemoQ. First, I go to the section for LiveDocs and I select the corpus in question. And then up in the ribbon, I click Import Reference File. Specifying the document as a reference file ensures that it is imported in its original format and not imported to MemoQ as indexed content, which might be used like a translation memory. Okay, I find the document that I want. In this case, a copy of the UN Declaration on the Rights of Indigenous Peoples in English. I click Open. I specify the language. And I add some keywords to make it easier for me to find the document. Okay, it's a PDF. UN Indigenous. Okay, and in the description field, I write something to tell me or other people what this is. And click Import. All right, and now if I want to find it in the list of documents, down below. I could scroll, but I, there's a lot of stuff there, so I'm going to use the keywords to filter. Okay, unclick show all. And I could look for PDF. That would show me all of the PDF documents that are here. Click away. Okay, there's quite a number of different PDF documents, but there is the document that I'm looking for. Okay, and I can also be a little bit more specific here. And if I look for, for example, the keyword indigenous, and I unclick PDF, then it finds the word indigenous in the description. It shows me only the reference document that I'm looking for. Now, the icon over on the left is a little bit different than the icon we're used to seeing for a PDF. That icon indicates that this is a document in its original format. The jargon used for this by MemoQ is binary. But let's just double click this and see what happens. And here that document is opened up in the PDF reader that I use, in this particular case, Adobe Acrobat, and I can use this as a reference document. Or if I'm using the PDF preview tool, I can take the downloaded document, which will be in my downloads folder on my computer, and use that with the MemoQ PDF preview tool in order to see the content that I might be translating in a text file or an XLIF in its original context.